A majority of modern fountain pens are built with a cartridge converter filling system. This means that the fountain pen can either accept disposable ink cartridges or use the refillable piston converter that draws ink from a bottle. In this video, we are pitting both of these methods in bloody battle to see who will triumph gloriously. Introducing first, in this corner, containing approximately 1.15 milliliters of royal blue ink, hailing from Heidelberg, Germany, the commander of convenience, Karl von Cartridge. And in this corner, wearing the clear reservoir with the red piston knob, five times refilled with different inks, the instigator of inky fingers, Cassius Converter! Let's get ready to rumble! Round 1. Convenience. Cartridges are, by far, the easiest between the two. They are fully supplied with ink, so when you pop that sucker into the front section of your fountain pen and hear that satisfying snap of the insert being pierced, you know you are moments away from writing the great American novel, signing your expense reports, or writing a passive-aggressive note to the noisy neighbor upstairs. Hey, be quiet down there. No, you be quiet! No mess filling your pen, but it does take a few moments to get that ink into the feed and to the point. To juice the process, I usually like to give the ink cartridge a gentle squeeze with my thumb and forefinger to get the ink down faster. Removal is as easy as taking out the empty cartridge and throwing it away. Rinse the nib out under cool tap water and you're good to go for another refill of ink. To fill a converter, insert it in the same manner that you would a cartridge. Seat it properly into the front section of the pen. Then, submerge the nib and feed into your bottle of fountain pen ink. Screw the knob clockwise to draw ink up through the nib into the converter's ink chamber. Screw anti or counterclockwise to expel the contents, air, ink, or water out of the converter. This may take several twists up and down to get the proper suction, making sure all of the air is removed from the container and that you are drawing up only ink. Filling via converter is a process that takes several tries to get a handle on, and novices are sure to get their fingers a little bit inky at first. Heck, even I get inky sometimes. The intimidating part about using a converter over a cartridge is the potential messy process. To prevent a potential inky disaster, keep some paper towels or a cleaning cloth on hand. Keep the bottle on a flat, level surface with a towel sheet underneath for added protection. Keep your fingers clear of the bottle opening when operating the converter and make sure to wipe your nib and section thoroughly before assembling the pen back together. Round, Round two, two, cost. The limitation of the cartridge is that they are disposable, hurting the environment and your wallet at the same time. Buying box after box of cartridge isn't as cost effective as refilling from bottles of ink. A single use ink cartridge may only get you about one milliliter of fountain pen ink, whereas the typical bottle ink contains about 30 to 50 milliliters. Driving the cost down per milliliter to a fraction of what it costs for the same ink in cartridge form. When it comes to selecting the color of ink to write with, the ink cartridge is like going to Disney World and being told that It's a Small World was the only ride you could go on. There's hardly any color variety when compared to bottled ink. If you use a fountain pen that has a proprietary ink cartridge, you're limited to only a small palette of colors that the pen manufacturer makes. True, you could refill an ink cartridge with a blunt needle syringe, but why go through the, all the trouble and the appearance of running a meth lab when a converter can accomplish the same task? Judge's decision. So, who is the winner of this matchup? Let us know in the comments below. Stay tuned for the next segment in our beginner series on writing instruments by subscribing to the Goldspot Pens YouTube channel. You can follow us on all the socials at Goldspot Pens. Have a great day and stay inky, my friends. Take care.